Hey Scorpios, this is your November 2019 love reading. We're going to see what you guys are preparing yourself for in love. All right. Let's make cards for Scorpio. Summer Rising and Venus sign. I love this card there. Uh oh. One more time. For Scorpio. It feels rigid for some reason. <laughs> While I was shuffling the cards, everything felt so rigid. You have the Four of Pentacles here, okay? Holding on very tightly to resources to your, yeah, someone's done you wrong that's what it is you got the justice card here in reverse you're not trusting right now been treated unfairly okay you said enough for yourself look at that you're looking at this justice card like i am not even playing you know what i'm not gonna stand for this you're not gonna treat me like this anymore you're not gonna talk to me like this anymore okay you're not gonna take advantage of me steal my money okay uh mistreat <laughs> mistreat me that's what it feels like with that justice card there, okay? Someone may be going through some legal issues with someone that they love as well, okay? It's an overwhelming feeling, but you have to stand up for yourself. This is going to end soon. Something's coming to an end, okay? With that justice card being in reverse, um, I want those words. Ooh, man, you have the six of wands here in reverse. You're still going to feel crazy about whatever ending this is for you, Scorpio. Um, this may be a legal battle that some of you guys are dealing with, okay? But you're going to feel like you got, you got got, <laughs> okay? Like somebody just really took advantage of you here it almost feels like you're not going to win some case that's what it feels like the justice card is really um pulling in some energy let's clarify this for you okay some of you guys may be going through some um divorce as well okay you gotta pay someone alimony you gotta do something okay um Give someone half your stuff. You're holding on to it tight. You're like, look, I work for this. You can't just take what I have. Okay. What is the six of wands here for my Scorpios? Someone's asking for more money. Okay. Or you are having to put out more money than the other person here they're not giving to the the relationship to the family to the connection you have the knight of cups here okay someone is very unfaithful and truthful um about what they're doing their moves okay like i ain't got it i ain't got it yeah but they do they got it okay um someone's not <clears throat> not loving you right okay yeah, they lying. You have the Ace of Swords here in reverse and the Death card here in reverse. They're not truthful, okay? That's why this is ending. Uh, I feel like it's a little, um, the universe bringing it to an end or uh, bringing some awareness to you. Um, okay, that's why you're looking at it like this, okay? Like I see you sneaking around, <laughs> not being loyal. <laughs> Okay. Why well, is a justice card here in reverse? Why? Look at all these swords. Oh my goodness. Okay. Yeah. It may be a few people that are around you. Okay. This is not only pertaining to a lover. It could be friends and family, and it could yeah. People that you thought you can trust and you really can't. Okay. I keep saying okay. Mm, sorry about that. 
Why is this four of pentacles here for Scorpio? Oh, you will be vindicated. I will say the word now. I've been holding on to that word forever. <laughs> I didn't want to say it, okay? Keep holding on there, Scorpio, okay? You got the sun card here. So bringing in some much needed clarity and good um, energy, okay? You're going to have success in light of losing. You didn't lose. You're not losing here. Let's go ahead and see what this person is thinking. What's on this person's mind? What's on Scorpio's person's mind here? November 2019. Beauty still moves me. S take that with a grain of salt. Seeing you reminds me of the things I know deep down, and that's not always easy to deal with. Okay. I got spooked. Maybe telling lies and lies on top of lies. I've never forgotten you, even though you think I have. Being self-centered and arrogant. Okay, with yeah i just have to do something else right now please try and understand okay maybe they're sneaking away that's what that is okay or sneaked away let's see let's uh bring out how they feel towards a connection with you, Scorpio. How does this person feel towards a connection with my Scorpios? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like it's over. You can come out again. I dare you. The justice card is here. And reverse again. Look at them withdrawn. They're like, I'm done. Okay, I can just hear it. Okay, let me just let this go. Two major arcana cards just letting me know they want to be single. They want to be free from the connection. Nine of pentacles there. Look, I dare you. I dare you. The knight of cups is back. Okay. This is so straightforward. It's crazy. Okay, they're looking for new love. Thank you for being clear. All right. That's how your person feels towards a connection. And take you right on up. Thank you for being crystal clear. Let's get some advice for you here, Scorpio. Let's give me the cards for Scorpio. Mm. What advice do you have for them in love? True love. Okay. <laughs> this is the romance of a lifetime. Deception. Someone is wearing a false mask in the relationship. Okay. Wedding. Then I say someone was married. The situation involves marriage. Someone's stepping outside of their marriage. Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. Let's throw. Some clarifiers in here and get a little bit more advice for you here, Scorpio. Why is release your ex here for Scorpio? Oh, jeez. I don't usually do this. Stabbed in the back here. Okay, release your ex. Stabbed in the back. Heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking truth, or shocking attack. I just threw that word in there. Lord. Okay. Wedding. Cassette, <sighs> wedding cassette, man, outdated thinking, conditioning, replaying events over in the head, okay? 
maybe it's a good memories here someone's re-watching things going reminiscing okay um deception why's deception here for scorpio yes the snake <laughs> yeah they're giving it to me straight right now okay competition enemy clever malicious okay look over your shoulder here scorpio the other woman, deception. Someone's wearing a false mask in the relationship. True love. Mm. That's true love here for my Scorpios. Twin flames. Zoom. 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 Okay. True love. This is the romance of a lifetime. So for some of you guys, this is a twin flame. You're dealing with yin yang. Uh, compliment each other coupling someone you're married to connected to okay let's get a outcome here for you what's a likely outcome here for my scorpios keep saying the ten of cups here Let's see what's going on. You're still going to find some happiness in your life created for yourself. Okay. okay. It's a likely outcome. Little Scorpio. Feels rigid. <sighs> Yikes. Okay, you have the five of wands here you're still gonna have conflict with someone three of cups here in reverse maybe you have to deal with them deal with their family um just deal with people that you don't want to deal with there's someone something you want to release okay this person is mean as hell queen of wands here um in reverse and will argue with you okay whoever you're dealing with okay what what else do you have here Oh my goodness. I feel like when this came out, they're taking you out of your element. They're like lowering your self-esteem or just trying to sabotage everything you're doing. It's just too much. And I feel like you're being called to, that's why you're being called to release it. Okay, release this person or whatever situation this is here. So it's not being honest anyway. You have deception in the snake up there. Okay judgment here but i feel like this is your own renewal that's coming up um or some they said epiphany or some enlightenment this is you i'm hearing giving birth to a new beginning it's weird words okay <laughs> weird words tonight all right i'll just let it go um <laughs> Let's look at December. What is going on for Scorpio and December here? Okay. Someone's dealing with a karmic situation. And that's another feeling that is coming up with that judgment card. That's why you feel so out of balance. Not so good about what's happening with the star card there. Okay. It's... It's emotionally messing you up. <clears throat> There's some calling for healing yourself. That's why you're being told to release whoever's stabbing you in your back. A retreat. It's time to disconnect. Okay. Codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life in December here. That's why the five of cups here came out, okay? And flirt, extend, it, extend your lighthearted energy to others. Maybe you're being called to flirt or do something like that. So your energy raises up and you know, um, that you're still lovable, that you still have it, you still got it, okay? Extend your lighthearted energy. Don't let someone drag you down here. That's what I'm feeling. Because everything feels so rigid. So when there's a lot of conflict coming in. Okay. And someone trying to uh, 
diminish you or lower your self-esteem. That's what I was feeling before, okay? That's what I was saying. Flirt, go out there. Let people see you. Extend your lighthearted energy. This doesn't have to be dating or just going out there sleeping with people. This could just be you going out, having a good time, going dancing, drinking, going to the bar, whatever you do. Okay, whatever. Makes you feel good, okay? Um, and connecting with people here in December. We're going to revisit this, though. Scorpio, okay? Thank you guys so much for coming back to watch your reading. This is your love reading for November 2019. Take care of yourselves, okay? Like, subscribe, and share this video. For me, it does matter. It does help the channel. I do uh, appreciate all of you guys that actually take action and do that, okay? Take care of yourself. Hit the notification bell. I'll be back with you, okay? Love you. Bye.